Hey YouTube. Got a few things done. Joystick for the western plow. That's all corrected. I put it together once. It wasn't right. I have no idea what went wrong. I seen a few things. I pulled it apart and went over it and went back together and it looks like it went together the right way. I don't know. Strange. I uh, changed the cables. Uh, getting ready for the upcoming snow season, I guess. Uh, it's a reasonable day. This is a perfect day to uh, finish things up and initially hook up and uh, adjust these lines right here. Got the adjustments on both of them. We'll trim them accordingly. Put it on and see where my adjustments have to be. And uh, hopefully it's going to be a go. Uh, I've already added some oil to that pump. But what I want to do is add a little bit more of another another uh, container and this is what's used um it's got a dextron rating to it which is what these systems call for i want to borrow this guy i would use that oil but i don't know i don't trust it See if I can do this one handed or not. We're not going to use the whole thing here. Not on this one. Snug that up so it don't leak. Mm. Perfect. We're going to put in approximately uh, a quarter to almost half of this in here, in this cavity, with what's already in there. I used to have a dipstick. I used to dip check. You can't put it in fast because it gets um, air bound and it won't go down. This is a non vented unit. I got to bleed that one line too. Had to change that pipe and that whole hose is dry <laughs> like I said late season we'll see about doing a couple snowplow videos see what happens I think that'll do. Uh, you can't see it. Yeah, you can. <laughs> if I see it, I guess you can see it. Just about a quarter, quarter of that quart. So I've already got one in there. And yeah, just plug in place. 
We're not going to snug it because we're going to have to add for sure. Gonna it, just going to put it in there. Like that. Um... <laughs> Purge that. Uh, I gotta purge that. Just put that back like this. A second. There we go. I need a rag. Weather's getting me a little bit. Work. Um, I'm going to put this on pause and see if I can restart the same video or not. Okay. What I'm trying to do is take and get hooked up here. Oh, I'm off. God damn, Briars! Gonna move over. Um, yeah. Square up and move it over a little bit. I usually got a science at doing this. This is usually almost how it's done. That plow is just a shade wider in the pickup. And all you gotta do is get your deck right. a while okay I'm gonna come back to you when I get this right okay I think I got it one try after that looks like I got it yeah I do have it I gotta come in some more that far back a little bit yep so close yeah um it's pain the balls lean back on it back. Briars are messing me up for like something fierce on that side. Um, I gotta move this thing back. Make it line up. I can't get a good hold on it for briars and slide it, you know, a little bit. That might do it right there.
I'm not, uh, I'm moving this. I'm not working these briars. I hate it. Did that do anything? Ouch. Yeah, it did, but it's not enough. Yeah, it's out of center. This is the shit that sucks. This is what takes the time. Wow. Dragging the whole works with me. What I wanted it to do was um, pivot a little so it'll straighten up and so it'll line up with that, with that pin. If I got it set up on wood so it's easier to work with and all it doesn't rot, it's sliding. Well, I guess I got to deal with Fires. See what I mean? How's that? Any better? No. Um, nuts. What happens? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, I can't do this one-handed. Catch you in a minute. That isn't going to work. Put the chain on it, see if we can lift it and walk it out. I'm only moving it anyway. I'm going to have to make another video, part two. Thanks for looking. Be sure to check the part two out. Thanks.